Welcome to a new thing that I'm doing. Okay, so this is um that was so just uh that, that was weird, that was weird, right? That was weird. I know it was weird. Okay, so this is a thing where I've been doing. Um I, I have WW2K14 as you just saw. And I do universe mode, as you may know. And, um, interestingly enough, I just started a new universe mode, a new year of universe mode, and as I just started my YouTube channel, I so, why don't I just do some reviews, well, not really reviews, slash highlights of uh, my uh, 2K14 universe mode stuff. Um, I can't actually record the gameplay, sadly, because this is my phone, it won't, I won't be able to do, like, put up all the matches or anything like that, so I'll just be doing pay-per-views and I'll be talking about the pay-per-views. I won't actually be recording any video whatsoever. So, yeah, so obviously I did um, my Extreme Rules pay-per-view a while back, um, and obviously I wanted to talk about it, so let me just do the actual uh, results. So, in the match, in the show, there was about, I don't know how many, uh, show, uh, how many matches. Um, it was, it, obviously there's seven matches, I can't remember what matches there was. Um, so I'll just, uh, refer to my, uh, word pad again, because that's how this works. That, that's how I work, I, I use word pad. If you're hearing something in the background, that's a video I was watching. Um, funny enough, 2K15 universe mode. Uh, so yeah, I just I felt like I needed to do this. I, I'm thinking, yeah, hey, I might as well do this. So yeah. Also, I need to check the time because if I'm not uh, careful, time will the 15 minute limit will uh, expire. So I need to. Act fast. If you just saw a bright flash, ignore everything. Okay. And boom. Alright then. So, this is uh, the results for Extreme Rules. So, first off, we had... Yeah, I can't... Um, I remember this. Titus O'Neil versus Darren Young in an Extreme Rules match where Titus actually beat Darren. Now, the story behind this was in a tag team match, I think they were reversing uh, the... um. Who are they facing again? Tons of Funk. They were fighting tons of Funk. And in the middle of the match, Tyson O'Neill randomly punches <laughs> Darren in the face, walking out on him. Obviously, you know, Darren is upset. I gave them a ton of matches during the actual shows, in which Titus won most of them, but Darren actually won one. I think actually two. He won the one I in the middle of the weeks, um, I can't remember like the second or third week on SmackDown. Oh, and then you know, the last day, the last SmackDown. So I mean, you know, he had some momentum heading into Extreme Rules, but ultimately Tyson will beat him to a pulp. So it was an Extreme Rules match. On uh, on the outside, they fought on the outside most of the time. You know, um, they went through the tables. They did a bunch of stuff to hit their finishers and everything. Finally, uh, Titus rolls Darren into the ring, hits the clash of Titus. One, two, three, it's over. Titus O'Neil beat Darren Young. So, technically, the, the traitor wins in this um, because he got betrayed. He betrayed his tag team partner, Darren Young. As you can see, Titus O'Neil beat Darren Young. Extreme rules match. Okay, so the second match I had was AJ Lee beat Layla in a WWE Divas Championship match. It was a singles match for the WWE Divas Championship. So, obviously, uh, AJ beat Layla, and she retained her title. Um, now, there's something interesting that happened, and uh, this might be spoilers for, like, later on. But, um, <clears throat> during the week, it, Layla beat Natalia on SmackDown or Superstars, I think it was Superstars, to see who would become the number one contender for the Divas Championship. Layla um, uh, obviously won that match, and, you know, 
it was a week before the actual pay per view. Now, on Raw and SmackDown, AJ had matches with Oksana. Um, yes, that Oksana. And I, to my disbelief, Oksana beat her twice. Like, both times. Hit, hit her spine buster thing, move, and uh, beat her both times. Which I, I said, wow, I should give her a championship match. Well, I already got Layla fighting, so technically I came up with a story saying, Layla was was the one who pit Oksana against AJ to the lower momentum or something like that. I can't remember. Um, so you know, into the extreme into extreme rules, uh, AJ and Layla have their match now. I was expecting Layla to win, but you know, I, deep down in my gut, I wanted uh, AJ to win. But I I just I felt like. Layla should have, could have won, because, you know, AJ had less momentum, Layla's just the better one, but, um, AJ, at the end of the match, I think Layla hit her, um, kick to the head, her roundhouse kick to the head, pinned AJ, AJ kicked out, went for her, uh, layout, actually, no, she hit the layout, went for the pin, AJ kicked out at 2.99999, she went for the the uh, her uh, kick, her bombshell kick, I think she called it. AJ reverses and hits the uh, her enziguri one, two, three. That was probably the greatest match. Like the actual match itself was really good. It was back and forth and everything like that. But um, <clears throat> that ending was like really cool. So. <laughs> Yeah, I've never had that kind of ending. I wasn't playing as anybody. I don't play as anybody in my universe mode because I want to get. I want it to be fair. I don't want to, you know, be like real wrestling where they determine the winner. Um. So yeah. Um. I'm I'm gonna have to do this in two parts. Seven minutes already. I only covered two matches. So next we have Rey Mysterio and Sin Cara beat Damian Sandow in a handicap match. Now. The story behind this one is Damien Sandow just beat Rey Mysterio and Sin Cara. Both of them clean the matches before. Sin Cara already never won an actual match. Damien won every single match. And, you know, they they got mad, demanded a, uh, a handicap match against Damien, and then into the match... It's, it's pretty much like the singles matches, except they were, both of them f- were fighting. Damien dominated most of the match. It's like he kicked their butts. Um, yeah, and, you know, he m- may have won the match about, like, f- five times, but obviously the other one was there to break up the pin. And uh, Damien... He he lost. Um, at the end, ultimately, Sin Cara hit no Ray hit the six one nine. No Ray hit his uh Mysterio kick that like stomped to the stomach and then kicked to the face and then tagged in Sin Cara. Sin Cara hit the Swanton one two three guaranteed victory. Um, so yeah, I mean obviously that I would obviously uh they would have won that. Uh, by the way, Rim Stereo and Sin Cara's name, Brace for Epicness, Car Stereo. Let's get to the next. Let's get to the next match. So, this was the for the Intercontinental Championship match. It was a two out of three falls match between Wade Barrett, who was the current Intercontinental Champion, versus Dolph Ziggler. So, the match was. Just like Tyus O'Neal and Darren Young's match. It was outside of the ring. Dolph and Wade fighting on the outside. Nothing really happening. Um, I mean, they were fighting. Things happened, but they were fighting on the outside. Barely inside. Um, and, and because I had false count anywhere on, they both did their, um, got falls on the outside. So Wade hit the bull hammer on the outside, got a win. Got one fall. Dolph Ziggler hit the zigzag again on the outside. Got another fall. And then they, you know, continue fighting on the outside. Wade brought Dolph in the ring. 
hit the wasteland. One, two, three. Wade Barrett retains the championship, um, getting two out of the three falls that he needed. Um, so yeah. Uh, Dolph actually beat well, won a triple threat match between Christian, him, and The Miz, and you know got his chance and lost it. Uh, now I'm at ten minutes. I, I need to hurry up. So we got Roman Reigns and you know you know what? No, 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 no. Okay, I I figured out. I'm gonna stop the video here and then the next video, which I'll, I'll upload as soon as possible after this one, I'll uh, talk about the main event matches. So um. Yeah, hope you uh, enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And, um, yeah. I have nothing else to say. I have, I have the worst outro. Anyways, ta-ta.